I'm going to real quickly show you how to do a mask in DaVinci Resolve. So as you can see in the video here, I've got this coffee spill down on the lower right, and I don't want that to show. So what I did is I took a still of that and edited it into a JPEG and cleaned up the coffee spill on the right. I'm going to drop that JPEG over my video clip. But of course, you can see what happens is, well, it's a JPEG, right? We don't see the coffee coming in and pouring. So what I need to do is mask out half of this image. So the two layers are above and below each other. I'm going to go into the color page in DaVinci. I want to start down here in the middle. Select this one here, your windows, and this is going to give you your masking options. So we can do different types. I'm going to grab the pen tool and I'm just going to mask out half that image. And you just click, click it up over here. Now you can be very precise. For example, if you want to go around the cup, if you're masking specific objects, you can adjust the points if you need to. But in my case, it's pretty basic. I'm just masking half the half the video and half the image. So I'm just going to crawl, draw a really big one around the edges here. And like I said, you can adjust it if you need to. But I'm doing a big one for this video to make it quick so that you don't have to sit here and listen to me forever. All right, now I've masked it. Over in your nodes, you want to right click and you want to add alpha output. That'll give you this little blue one here. Just click it and drag it over to the blue here. And you can see now when I did that, notice we can now see the coffee because basically what it did is it added the mask here instead of here. No problem at all. All you need to do if you want to reverse it, and I did that on purpose for that reason, is if you want to reverse it, just go down here and click this. And notice what happened. Now we can see the coffee coming in being poured and the right doesn't have that coffee spill on it. So when I play the video, it looks like I want. I want the coffee comes in, we don't see the spill. A couple things that you can do with this as well is you can adjust it. So if you need to change where the mask is on the screen, you like I mentioned before, you can grab your anchor points. You can also adjust the softness if you want it to soft be a bit softer as it comes in and out. Um, you can tilt it, adjust the opacity if you want. So maybe I want a little bit of that coffee showing for some reason, I can do that. But that's it. That's a real quick and simple how to do a mask in DaVinci Resolve.